What's up guys, Black Horse here and welcome back to another video and today we're back on Tour de France 2020 for stage number 12 of our 2020 Tour de France playthrough with Trek Segafredo. Today's episode will take us from Chauvigny to Saran Corrèze, 219 kilometers um, with somewhat of an accidented parkour, um, mostly in the second half of the race and as we'll approach uh, Saran we'll have a, a bit more... Um, gradient by the looks of it with a second category climb the call uh, du suc ome with um a narrow path just uh well but well, during the climb would will have to be a uh, well placed that's the first or well, new danger we haven't encountered yet on this tour de france uh, so we'll have to be extremely careful about that but they can they classify boku Molima as my leader today obviously that will not be the case obviously our leader today will have to be none other than uh vincent nibbly but without further ado, let's jump in this stage and see what Vincenzo and Trexigafredo can do between Chauvigny and Sal. And we are on the way for uh, this race. Uh, a very cloudy day as the jerseys aren't exactly very bright by the looks of it. Uh, but we're going to try and send Edouard Tunes in the breakaway. Uh, see if, in, if we can go in here. If it's a mass sprint, I mean it's not going to be a mass sprint. They're so we won't be able to take any behind. points here. Uh, uh, what? Port Nibali shouldn't, yeah? Somehow I'm not convinced that this is a good breakaway. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna try and get like the breakaway with Edouard uh, and maybe just try to like get the points at the intermediate sprints. We're 144, we were 25 points behind Trenton, I believe, because yeah, we're 13 square. So. We're going to try what we can to, to see if we can get the points for the Dortons and catch up to uh, the uh, European champion in-game. Alright, we have uh, a 12-man group at the front. It took some time to uh, to like form itself, but we do have it now. Uh, we've got Edouard Tons, Mikkel, Valgren, Nikita Abstra, Henrik Maas, Tom Yelte Slachter, Sergio Higuita, Philippe Gilbert, Rudy Mollard, Domenico Poduvo, Ryan Taramae, pretty sure we do have some other names as well. Uh, we do. We've got Elie Gébert and uh, Quentin Paché, I believe. Yep, the gap is 4 minutes and 12 seconds on the peloton. I said it took some time to, to get formed. We nearly had no energy, which is why we've used already our gel, uh, or at least our blue gel. But yeah, now uh, we just need to stay in this group. Right, we do have an intimate uh, uh, climb coming up He's quite soon. I mean, I'm just going to try and stay in this group. I don't think... I'd, I'd, I'm hoping that they don't, they don't all attack. Uh, what I'm also hoping is that Higuita doesn't take the points. Although, I mean, there's only two points. And he is 66 points behind Richie Port. So that should be quite good on this end. But yeah, the, the less t points he takes, the better. We're even taking the lead of the group for now. Uh, just pacing at a very steady rhythm. Uh, and they have started their efforts. We're just going to make sure that we stay with them. Don't do anything dumb. Eddie Gebert has collapsed. I'm pretty sure I could have gotten the points if I wanted, but it's fine. I'll just make sure to stay with them. Quand on the gets the two points uh, available at this climb. Right, nice. We move. Popular right, across the summit Raymond of this Pouillard. little climb. Uh, what I'm surprised though. Enric Mas, Ryan Tarame, Quentin Pache, and Dominic Obituvo got dropped. They were like the four best climbers of the group with Higuita. That's surprising. That really is. Alright, two kilometers onto the sprint. Just making sure that we stay in a, a rather high position again. Taking maybe a, a wheel or someone. No. Okay, we'll just see if anyone goes for the sprint. Yep, Nikita Trados. Nikita Trados. So we're gonna have to follow that. Gilbert is quick. Jesus Christ. Philippe, man. But we're going to cross the line in first in this intermediate sprint. You've won the intermediate sprint. Well done. Okay, good. That's going to put me plus 20, so I'm going to be on virtually 164 points. The question is, who's going to get the points in the peloton? They are, after all, 1.6 kilometers away from it. Uh, let's just hope that Trentin doesn't take any points, but I believe he will. He is, after all, um, backing. Well, he's got back-to-back -back stages, so he does have some quite some level. There's only three points available though. 
Right, three points is not much. Three points is not much. Then Trenton got three. For fuck's sake. Right, we finished the job in the breakaway, like, the we're gonna let them uh, just do their thing at the front. The if Edwardsons can stay with the guys, that's good. If he doesn't, that's I. Um, Vincent who cannot take corners, and that has nothing to do with me, by the way. The uh, okay. Left. 46 the meters left. We're gonna to have end. a climb coming up right now, then another climb, where we have to be extremely careful of what we do. Where the slope is right, we're going to start this wall uh, that people have been talking about. Well, I mean, by people, I do mean my sportive director. Um, is that wait? Is that Roglic will song? Please don't tell me it's Roglic will song. It was a girl in Van Art. Good. Uh, right, we can like have a low rhythm for now. I'm going to catch Bob Lindos. You've got to keep up the rhythm to defend the yellow jersey. Yeah, yeah. Shall I ca calm down, boss man? Where's like the 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 Bauke and the Ritchie? I'm right guessing they're still here. It was is slightly up the road. Uh, how is he lo doing? All right, wait for me. Good. Uh, Bauke, you'll stay there. Ritchie, you're gonna protect me. Nice. And Julio, you're gonna protect Bauke. And Bauke, you're gonna put a tempo at like 100. Okay. Let's see what thing up. Who's in the group Schachmann? Julien slapped uh, Schachmann. No, okay, it's fine. It's fine, it's not much of an issue. Peloton got dropped. Is it a Peloton with Boca? Uh, it could be. I hope it isn't, but I think it is. That's sad. But Vincenzo is putting a nice, a nice rhythm at the front of this group right now. Even though we're currently getting dropped. Strangely enough. Is it Watson's already with me? Wow, that was quick. Calling the breakaway the might the go and take the win here. There's everything to play for. The breakaway could go and take the win. There are three minutes fifty in the lead. Um, at the front of the peloton. What you, fuck off, Rigosta. He greeted Gebert. Could fight. Oi, Ala Philippe take, has taken two minutes on me. <laughs> I mean, I'd stopped pacing for a bit. Oh, I'm actually abysmal in a downhill. Jesus Christ. Like, I had stopped pacing for a bit in the climb, but, uh, because I went and simulate, well, simulate, accelerated the rhythm. Uh, and the game just made me stop pacing. I think that was way standing. too aggressive. But Vincent is just doing the descent on his own. We did drop a lot of riders though, like I'm seeing Thibaut Pinot getting dropped. We got a little screen freeze because of the loading screen and that made me lose time. Uh, could I stay with the uh, Rui Costa? I don't think I can. I don't think it's worth it actually. Left to play for. Right, Boca got dropped for some odd reason. I, d I actually don't know why, because he's got full energy and shit. Uh, that's not good, Boca man. Come back. I kind of need you. Only five kilometers left for the right, final seven race. kilometers. The breakaway will definitely take the win. Uh, but the question is, is it going to be Higuita? Will it be Rudy Mola or will it be Schachmann or Ala Philippe? The question is worth being asked. 38 seconds, the two fr the two uh, he oh, well, classic guys are genuinely coming back, they've gained 4 minutes on us, and that has nothing to do with the fact that we completely the stopped pacing. Front is onto the long false flat that leads to the right, finish. Big aerodynamic here, yeah? at a 3% gradient, that's, that's solid. Right, well, who's in the group Martin? Gil uh, okay, just Gilbert and then Martin, nice. Julio, you're meant to protect me, and that means go ahead of me. You're actually stupid, Jesus. Big section of corners. We've actually kind of dropped them as well, that's quite cool. Okay. We've actually dropped, like, some of the riders there. Yeah, we've actually dropped them, that's quite cool. Uh, wait, no, Bauke, 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 go, on go 100, Bauke. Yeah, Shikone will go 100, uh, 110, Boka will go 110. Because we've actually dropped the peloton here. <laughs> incredible. Absolutely incredible. 2.3 kilometers. Higuita has been co-op by Julien Lafilippe. Higuita has been co-op by Julien Lafilippe. And Julien Lafilippe has dropped Higuita. Uh, meanwhile, the peloton is not catching me. That's good. 1.5k. 
Bauka, you're gonna consume a uh, red gel, and you're gonna pace 100, and you're gonna attack. Okay. We're I'll gonna follow Bauka in his attack. We're going to follow Bauka in his attack. We didn't. We did not follow him, sadly. That is rather sad. Watch out! You'll soon have no more energy for an attack. I mean, Bauka is going to be the one to drop me. <laughs> Bauka has actually dropped me. Incredible. It's going to be seventh and eighth for us. Oh, come on, Vincent. So nice. That was a very odd finish. That was a very, very odd finish. It's a French win. So then Saron, as Julien Lafilippe takes the W. Uh, very impressive win for, for Julien Lafilippe. He attacked quite far from the line in uh, the uh, Suc au Mur, I think, uh, with Schachmann and uh, went home to bring home the W, even gaining a 4 minute gap on the peloton. That's quite massive. But uh, that doesn't change anything GC wise as Vincenzo Nibali retains the yellow jersey of Leader. The green jersey stays on the shoulders of Matteo Trentin, even though Edwalton's made a slight comeback. Richie Port is still the best climber and Bernal is still the best young rider. That doesn't change, I don't think it will. Alright, uh, Julien takes the dub, same time as he beat uh, Schachmann in third. We come home in seven and eight with Moleman Nibali. Uh, I mean, yeah, I don't think I could have done anything here. Probably catch Dan Martin if I had played better with Nibeli. Or maybe follow Hala Philippe and Schachmann if I had really wanted to, but I didn't. It's, I mean, that doesn't really matter, does it? Because GC wise, we stand the lead. Hala Philippe makes a nice comeback in the top 10, overtaking Remco Evenepoel in the GC. Uh, Molima is the only one that gains time with, uh, well, in, in the top 5, so that's quite cool. He's still 8 minutes 29 behind. Mountain wise, that doesn't change. Points wise, we make a comeback. We're now 8 points behind Matteo Trentin, but uh, our condition is looking quite, quite peak. Bernal is still the best rider, that doesn't change either. He greeted John Tade Pugachar, interesting. And uh, Trek is still the best team. Get in. Uh, anything combativity wise? Nope, it's still Ben Hammond. But that, nevertheless, shall be the end of uh, the stage numero 12 of our Trek Segafredo playthrough. Um, I do hope you've enjoyed it. If you did, then please do leave a like down below. Follow me on my social medias, the links are in the description as well. Um, and yeah, if you're new on here, then please consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't done so already. I shall catch you in the very next episode. But my name has been Blackwater, it's been an absolute pleasure talking to you guys, and goodbye. Pull up, pull up in the gold, I'm leading. All them other man need feeding, I don't wanna go bombi Them I don't know what I do when I go from feeling Leading the pack in black and I'm on with the bad Snapping with the phone and dab, I'll stop a man with the duster Put him in the drip and sip blockbuster